Yes, I had to redo this video because I did misspeak. Uh, I said something that was incorrect about the game, the game video. I took it down because I did say that it was incorrect. The overall premise of it is true, but I said something that was incorrect. And what I said was is that you're taking DC and converting it to AC voltage. And the signal is always AC voltage, whether it's coming from your radio, any signal that's not high input, and it's coming to your RCAs, <coughs> a speaker signal is AC. This is true, and it's being caught from and it's being converted from low AC into a high AC voltage at your speaker outputs. But this is being done by this is being used with DC voltage. That's why the more voltage you get in. The higher, the, the greater the ability of the amplifier, however it does it, to convert it to a higher output. The switching of the MOSFETs and everything that goes on inside the amplifier, which I'm not a technical guru on, is done with DC. And it's based on your input voltage. If your input voltage is high enough, then less work the amp has to do in getting it to what the amplifier is rated to amplify. For instance, like this falls gate is rated. The input voltage should not, ex well, they say it does its power with a five volt input. When you input anything into the RCAs, you're going to that's lower than five volts. You're going to have to use your gain, gain, match it, bring it up to five volts for the amplifier to work. The amplifier is gonna do its work at five volts input. If you send in a 1.5 volt input, you're gonna turn that gain up to get to the five volt input. I'm not changing that. That's what I know as a fact, and I'm gonna to stick to that. What I misstated is when I said that you're taking converting DC into AC voltage. No, DC is what power the amplifier to amplify low AC voltage the RCAs into a high AC voltage. But that gain setting is to make is to help the amplifier get to what it needs to make its full rated power. So if you got a 1.5 or 2 volt signal going coming in and your amplifier needs a 5 volt signal, you're going to, have to turn that gain up so you can add the 3 to the 2 to get 5. You're going to have to do that because that's what Amplifier works at. Its input voltage is 5. But what if you don't turn up the 5? What's going to happen there? You're not going to get the full power of the amp. You're not going to get the full power of the amp, but you will get some power. Read the sentence. Understand the sentence. You will not get the full power, the full ability of the Amplifier, but you will get some power. If you want to get the full power, then the voltage is going to have to be matched to 5 volts so that when you turn your volume knob, you can get the full capability of the amplifier. Also, can you overdrive the inputs by running higher input voltages than necessary? Yes. Yes, you can overdrive them. But if you can keep that voltage level maxed out, then the amplifier doesn't have to do as much work. And yes, primarily, I guess I got to say everything because you got those who come on my comments and might mislead some of my subscribers. Yes, it must be a clean signal. I didn't know I had to say that. I put that pause in there so that'd be understood. Yes, it needs to be a clean signal. You don't want to amplify a dirty signal. Fact. I didn't know I had to say that. But since those that need to be, I'm going to say that for you. Yes, it needs to be a clean signal. But if you don't have a oscilloscope to find that out, use what everyone else used. Bag off three, turn your volume up full tilt, bag off a quarter. Bag off a quarter. If, you're, if, you're, uh, 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 if it's 100 units, bag off the 75 and let that be a clean signal going to your head unit. But you're still going to have to match. The gain is not a volume knob. It is to match the input voltage to what the amplifier needs to reach its full capability. Now, I was given credit for that, and that's great. That's great, yes, the, the, uh, the gain is not a volume knob, no. 
But everybody's got a, a different opinions of how things should be said. And this, that, I know some people think that they call the police. I don't don't really give a fuck. But I did watch that video and say, oh yeah, you know what? I did say something that, that the the newbies or the people that watch my channel might articulate to someone else, and they said, man, you you where you get that from? And it might be incorrect. So I'm going. I made a mistake, and I'm going to say it was the correct way of wording it. AC voltage. Coming in AC, AC voltage, low AC voltage coming in RCA inputs. Amplify the AC voltage on the speaker outputs. AC coming in, the signal, the source signal is always going to be AC. This is a fact. It's going to be amplified from low to high. That's why it's called an amplifier. The process by which this is done is DC voltage. The process by which this is done is DC voltage. That's why the greater your voltage going in, the higher your output going out. The easier is able to do what it needs to do without without getting any losses to heat. And your gain has to match that signal and bring it up so the amplifier can work correctly. If you can bring it up to where it's rated at, not all amplifiers are the same. Some operate at 9 volts. Some need a 4 volts input. Some need a 10 volt input. That's why you have line output adapters. A lot of me line output uh, devices. Uh, LOC line out converters and they have jumpers in there where you can increase your voltage your AC input voltage or AC output which would be the AC input on your amplifier they have the jumpers there for a reason because the stronger the signal you send out the less work the amplifier has to do the higher your noise threshold becomes you get a very very clean signal your amplifier runs clean smoothly now, let this video stay in the zone. If you don't like it now, I'm going to say what I said to you, to these gentlemen that spoke. What you need to do, since your channel is older than mine, get your video, spread the knowledge. Knowledge is not being shared is useless to the owner and to those that are around him. Knowledge that is not being shared is useless to the owner and to those around him. Einstein. Yeah. Help, don't hinder. Peace.